name is Bela Lisa. I'm the production coordinator for Earth Celebrations. And today we're here at White Box, a small gallery space in the Lower East Side with one of our ecological solutions workshops. Um, so today, you know, people are working on costumes with our artist in residence, Johanna Roa. Um, and, you know, we're just working on these three different costumes for our end of the you know cycle we have this procession on may 13th ecological city procession for climate solutions um you know looking for volunteers for these workshops as well as uh, the day of the procession yeah, i always enjoyed especially uh yeah, hey, Maeve. <laughs> How's it going? Good. This looks so beautiful. What is going on here? Thank you. Um, so I'm working on this hat. Um, right now I'm attaching the third layer. So it's been a couple weeks of effort. First, I took a baseball cap and then put a bunch of fabric over that. Then we have our second layer. Now our third. There are going to be some bells and buttons. It's going to be very exciting. Where are the bells and buttons going? Um, so the bells will hang from the sides of the hat, um, and then I'll put this button on top. That's so cute. What is the hat like? What is the part like? What is it symbolizing in the costume? Do you um, any idea? I'm not sure. I think that so this is part of um the Earth Solutions costume. Um, so it'll go on top of sort of like the many layered garment. So I feel like it's partially this complex just to sort of match the vibe of the garment itself. They're like little lily pads. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's so cute. Yeah. Are these gonna be a part of the uh solutions cluster? I don't think so. I think these are patches but I'm not actually sure what these patches wow. are. From. These are from past celebrations. So beautiful. Um, we'll see what else we're working on. Thank you. See ya. See ya. So we got something going on here. Wow, look at this. They're incorporating these archival photos. I mean, maybe for processions and parades and events. As you can see here, maybe this one was from the Save Our Gardens. Do you know when, when this photo was from? I don't know, but Felice still that she's 20 years old there. Right? Look, you notice? Look how young she looks. Oh, yeah, that's, that's the that's founder, Felicia. Felicia. That's what I was saying. This is an old So this picture. is probably from the Save Our Garden. Yes. Yeah. Um, I was looking for the photo, but I don't see that, well, you know, to show it's you, you know, where this cool. is, is going to be, but I don't see it. Those, this goes to this. We're still working on it. So these pieces go to that. And this is the climate, the green solution? Yeah. Yeah, the first, green the green solutions. solution. But this is the, the one that goes with the, I think this is the one with the tutu. Oh, that's right. I don't know what she has, so. Where are you looking for? Uh, yeah. There's a lot going on. Mm -hmm. Oh, she has it over there. Mm. So these are going on the two Yeah, because the grass is there. Mm. Is this going on that? Oh no. Oh, for the garden. For the garden. This is the garden. Okay. Garden. Okay. Okay. garden. Okay. Yeah. And these were from the, the Save Our Gardens. Yeah. yeah. The top is events already. Mm. The, the top the is already. I don't know. Someone is working on it. Yeah. We can see what they're working on. John. John is finished. It's finished. Yes. Yeah, that's the front, and it has. Mm. <gasps> wow. And this is the front. Okay. And those flowers are for the hat. Mm. Cool. And so then you guys are working on the skirt too, right? Uh, it's good, that yeah, right there. yeah, this is here. There's a pond, the top, the flowers for the hat. The pants down, mm -hmm. the shirt down. Working on. Yeah, good. not too fast. Not too fast. See, I, I'm getting stuck right there. I don't know why. 
Porque está el, el pin ahí. No, tienes que hacerlo más. Estás haciéndolo muy rápido. Hello. Good. Good. What are you working on? Um, I put out this flower on this to make some more so we can put it on the hat. And so right now I'm just finishing the edge so that we can make the flowers like this. Oh, cool. Sorry. Ah. So this pattern makes these flowers? Yes. So Celebration is focusing on water as well. And you know, like, I'm just wondering, as a community member who's been involved for a while, um, how do you feel that this is, you know, talking, speaking to the issues of, like, that the community gardens are facing around water, or just like how, how does this, how do these workshops and how do the end of the, how does this May 13th, for example, this celebration on May 13th, how do you feel like it's creating positive impact, like on community, or like, like just what are your feelings or thoughts about it, and like, what, what would you tell someone who's interested, for example, in being involved, like why, why, why do you think this is a good thing to do? Okay, so, um, I, I came in as an artist. Um, I got involved as an artist, and um, I wasn't looking at the moment at about the community and all that stuff. I'm being honest. Um, so when I first came in, they needed volunteers to be artists or to, to sew and stuff. And since I was already working on a project in the Lower East Side, I was told about this event, and I came to check it out. And I said, "Well, we need a lot of artists, and we need help." So I came in to help with Pedro. And um, I told them I can paint. They asked me what skills do you have, and I said I can paint. I can sew. If Pedro can sew. He can sew and do other stuff, and we can do a little bit of both. And they started telling us about how important it was to get involved with the the pageant. Um, Felicia explained to us, and um, I think it's important because all the things that are going around the world now, um, if you notice the change in weather. Yeah. And so it's basically, you know, like the garden solutions and everything, the costumes are telling a story about what's going around the world and our community gardens and how we as a, as a, as a group, as a team, our world is, is out of balance. Mm -hmm. And um, by everybody coming together and creating these costumes and us, you know, going in the pageant, we saw on everybody the importance of, you know, all these different issues around the community. Mm -hmm. And there's more stuff for, you know, uh, but please get involved, get involved because Felicia's been doing this for 30 years and people just come in and they, they visit us and they do volunteer work and stuff. Some people don't wear the costumes, but it's a tremendous help to have everybody, you know, doing every little piece for the end when we have the pageant. But please join us and wear a costume. 
We've been doing Pedro and myself have been doing it for about six or seven years and and you learn so much from it. You learn it's for good folks. Thank you. Thank you so much, Rosa. That was just incredible. I'm um, I got a count. We need about this one is here. Oh, for this one. No, it's only on the bottom. Bottom and top. Yeah, that's okay. You know me? I tuning in. Um, we're here every Wednesday from 6 to 9 at White Fox, uh, small guy space on Avenue B in the Lower East Side. We also have a workshop on Saturdays from 12 to 4 at 6th Street Community Center. And the Wednesday workshop is we're working on costumes. If you have any interest in learning about sewing, textiles, costume making, please come. Um, yeah, and Saturdays is puppet making, so if you have any interest in that, please come on Saturdays. And we're looking for volunteers to join us for the May 13th major celebration. Um, Ecological City Procession for Climate Solutions is the, the name of the celebration on May 13th, and we hope that you will join us as a volunteer. We're looking for costume volunteers, we're looking for people to operate puppets, and we're looking for marshals. And all all types of volunteers so please you know reach out to us if you're interested and yeah i hope you guys have a great day thank you so much for tuning in bye hope to see you soon